I don't know why I'm here. Or what they think I've done. I'm innocent. This is wrong. I don't know what this place is for. Or what's going to happen to me here. I don't know if I can survive. All I know is... I'm locked up. With no chance of escape. Hi, my name is Mark Price, CEO of a fresh new game company called Kickflip Studios. I'm also the owner of a company called DevSlopes, where we've taught over 100,000 students how to code and build games. After helping tons of people get jobs in the industry, we finally decided to create our own game studio with our very first flagship title, Locked Up. I've always wondered, what would it be like if I was wrongfully accused and thrown into prison? And then I thought, well, if I was in prison for life, what would I do to escape? So I've been planning this game for a really long time, and I'm happy to announce that we're finally gonna build it. Locked Up is a 3D action RPG game that's just filled with grit and brutality. The player character is a prisoner who's been framed for a crime that they didn't commit, and they've been sent to a high-tech, high-security Antarctic prison. As the player, you must find a way to get passage out of this futuristic facility and uncover its dark secrets along the way. Utilizing the prison hierarchy, you'll form alliances or create nemeses to further you on your journey. Imagine a prison where the governments of the world sent their worst criminals and then had them return to them completely reformed. Corp X is the company behind this Antarctic prison, but would you be surprised to hear that this facility isn't what it seems to be? Exploring the depths of the prison and interacting with the interesting characters, each with unique backstories to learn about, you will discover the incredibly deep lore of the game and ultimately uncover a rich and unsettling story lurking beneath. We're taking RPG elements from some of our favorite games and putting our own unique twists on them. Uh, as you go through the game, you can either decide to get out through combat, uh, choose action, or you can be more diplomatic. Combat system is real time and we've crafted a unique combination of strategy and action together. Sometimes it's not always a good idea to fight. Sometimes you want to talk your way out of a situation or you want to use stealth to try and get to where you need to get to. We're building a rich dialogue and choice system in Locked Up. Everything you do has a consequence. What you say to other characters matters. And some choices can even permanently affect your reputation and game experience. Prison is gritty, it's rough, it's a very ugly environment. And we want to bring that into the art of the game. We're going to make things semi-realistic with a very dirty, dark tone for the characters, the dialogue, the textures, environments, everything. And I want to bring my experiences as a military police officer and dealing with prisoners into the game so we all have a very immersive simulation in our hands. We wanted the prison experience to feel real. You're going to be with the same characters every day. You're going to run into gangs and have to choose sides. Uh, making certain friends will make instant enemies in other places. And if you choose not to fight, other prisoners are going to notice. We also wanted the player to be uniquely attached to their character, which is why we're creating a character system that's very advanced. We want you to be able to pick your race, your body type, scars, tattoos, whether you're male or female. That way, the player can be very immersed into our story. The complexity and depth of the game goes deep. In the end, you're going to have to fight, sneak, craft items, join gangs, bribe guards, and do whatever you have to do to get out. The game takes place a few hundred years in the future, so we wanted to keep things grounded, but sci-fi enough that you could do things like grab a guard's assault rifle and disable the DNA lock so you can use it against them. You can also learn how to hack an android guard and have him help you in battle or assist you infiltrating different parts of the prison. You are in control of how you handle the story. So we've already begun development of the game, but we can't finish it without your help. We currently have a team of six people who are hard at work on the project. The funding from this campaign will give them the ability to keep working, as well as help us hire two more core team members. And there's one more thing I wanted to talk about. 
Our company roots are in coding and game education. So as a way to give back to you, we've created two rewards as part of this campaign that I think are amazing. First, we're creating a documentary on the development and publishing of this game. In fact, we've already started it. This will take you behind the scenes to see all of the things inside of Game Studio that you might not normally get to see. And secondly, we're creating a 20-hour course that's going to teach you how to build a game and Game Studio from scratch. We're going to teach you everything we did from the pre-planning to the funding to the development and tools to the management and the marketing and publishing of the game. Basically, it's the ultimate course on becoming an indie game developer and you can get this as one of the rewards. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please help us make Locked Up a reality by backing this project now. We wanted to make... <clears throat> we wanted to... That's filming. Okay. Locked Up is a 3D action up... I can't see. Because <laughs> you... Yeah. The game... Blah, blah, blah. Create a character that has... I say create too many. Times. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Combat system is real time. Sorry, I was reading it. Combat <laughs> system is real time, and we've created a unique. <laughs> Keep looking over at the computer. Ready? Yep. Are you filming this whole thing? Man? Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. I'm really appreciative of that. We've already started development. We've already started development of Locked Up. Six people! <laughs> They're human beings that. <laughs> eh? Lying. <clears throat> Dang it, Jacob, I was just about to start. <laughs> Sorry. I got excited. <laughs>